Good morning, everyone. So this is my breakfast. I had my latte again. I made it the same way. I just didn't add the hazelnut um, Starbucks sweetener. So it's just uh, one tablespoon of sugar-free French vanilla, two ounces almond milk, one Splenda. And then here I have an egg white omelet. And for that, I did one whole egg, 92 grams of egg whites, so two egg whites. One tablespoon of ketchup is on top. And then I used half a laughing cow um, this is the creamy, sp creamy spicy pepper jack cheese. It's really good. Um, I used the other half yesterday. And then, oh, and then I did three ounces of chicken and spinach. And then for my rice cake, I actually wanted toast, but we don't have bread, so that sucks. But I have one lightly salted rice cake with um, half a serving of the sugar-free strawberry uh, jam. And then half a serving of cashew fit. This is... Um, also, the people that sent me the cocoa nutters, they sent me these cashew butters. Um, it doesn't taste exactly like chocolate glazed donut. I like to think of it as cashew butter that has a slight chocolate taste to it. Um, but it's really good, especially when mixed with something else. So um, that's going to be my meal one for today. I'm actually very impressed with this chocolate PB rice cake thing that I made. It tastes delicious with my coffee. Um, but it's the cashew fit and I wanted to show you the macros. I forgot to show you. So one serving um, is two tablespoons. I used half a serving, but for the full serving, it's 13 grams of fat, eight carbs, and 10 grams of protein. So really high protein um, nut butter spread. The macros for breakfast are, uh, let's see, it's 328 calories, 21 grams of carbs, 14 grams of fat, and 25 grams of proteins. My next meal is lunch. It's this huge salad. I have spinach, spring mix, six ounces of chicken, 100 grams of strawberry, 32 grams of the Italian dressing that I used yesterday. Oh, and I'm gonna put that salad topping on there. Just one serving of my favorite one, which was this one, and I feel like there's only half a serving in there. So I'll get the final macros for this meal for you, but it's so much food. Yum. My next meal is 4.5 ounces of chicken, 16 grams of ketchup, reduced sugar, and one pickle. Kind of random, but I love this chicken and I love pickles, so delicious. Thor just wanted to say hi. Can you say hi? Say thank you everyone so much. We love you. <laughs> a little afternoon snack is a lightly salted rice cake I, on half of it I have the chocolate glazed donut and on the other half I have the caramel French toast so pretty delicious snack I couldn't wait to eat it because I was on the phone with Brandon I was like Brandon I love you but I gotta go because I'm eating this thing and I'm supposed to be recording everything so macros will be on the next screen, or maybe I'll just show you the daily macros. Whoa! Small snack. Four ounces of chicken and 104 grams of kale and quinoa. Nom nom. Yeah.
that is going to conclude uh, this reverse diet vlog day number two. So I was perfect on my macros again. Please tell me you don't believe that. I was not perfect on my macros today. Um, and I'm going to show you everything that did not fit my macros now. Okay, so what happened was everything was going great, right? <laughs> and then this damn chocolate chip cookie dough quest bar came into my life and I had to have it. And I was being a brat, so I had it. And then after that point, nothing that I wanted fit in my macros. So I had a few decisions. I had to make a decision of either not having any more food for the rest of the day or just having it anyways. So I chose to have it anyways. <laughs> You know, not positive that was the best decision, but I'm going to take every day's learning experience. I'm not going to be hard on myself because it is really hard post-show trying to, you know, balance that. Like, I technically can have it now, but still trying to reverse diet properly. So, um, what I learned today is that I really should not be trying to fit protein bars in my macros right now because um, then that leaves me with not a lot of whole food left and I would much rather have a whole food meal. Like I much rather would have had a chicken and quinoa meal um, for the same macros. Um, and then I also learned today um, that I should never try to substitute out things that I absolutely have to have, like my staples for every day. My staples for every day would be my level one ice cream sandwich protein shake from First Form. Uh, with almond milk and then my 100 calorie fudge bar. Don't judge me for that. It's so delicious and it's only 100 calories, 16 grams of carbs. Um, but those are, those are like my staples. Those are things that make me so happy that I just need to account for um, in the morning of every day and make sure that I don't try and substitute that out. So tomorrow's a new day. I'm going to try to do better today. I'm trying to be very open, honest with you guys. Um, I would much rather just, you know, pretend like I was perfect, but I am nowhere near perfect and it's really hard for me to, um, I, you know, I don't have like amazing self-control when it comes to food. Um, so I'm really just going to try my best and share it with you guys in hopes of helping you guys. Um, you know, if you mess up on your macros or you go over or whatever, um, don't be too hard on yourself. The amazing thing about macros is that every day that you wake up, they start at zero. So tomorrow is literally a new chance for me to do better. Um, now, I only went over by my macros um, or on my macros by having the protein shake and the fudge bar and then the chicken. So when you think about it, it's not like I went out and had some crazy bad food. You know, I just um, had that protein bar which made me go over. So, um, yeah, that's going to be it for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed that three minute long rant. Um, but anyways, if you're enjoying these daily vlogs, please like this video and also subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys tomorrow for vlog number three of my reverse diet. And let's hope for a better day tomorrow. I'm going to do my best to do better. So I'll share with you guys how I end up doing. I hope you have a great day and I hope you hit your macros. <laughs> Bye. Audio